Hi guys and welcome to Lowell's Den. I'm Julian and today I'm going to be going over two Harley Quinn figurines that I have in my possession. One I received on my birthday from Krypton's Fortress and the other one I received at Christmas. Now just a little thing I wanted to say. I was supposed to put a video out last week of my Let's Play uh, Dungeon of Endless. My first video was just me going over a little bit of the mechanics of the game but uh, from there on forward uh, they're on out. I'm going to be doing uh, just straight out Let's Plays. I also have another one that's going to be coming out. It's going to be of Sid Meier's Beyond Earth. I had to remember the game. Um, so, that'll be coming out soon. I'll be doing a Let's Play of that. Uh, my first video ran about an hour, so I'm going to have to break that one up a bit. And uh, also, there's another person that's been doing videos. Come here. This is 3D Andrew. Say hi. Hi. So he's going to be doing some online games. Well, mostly multiplayer games with me. My indie games that I need two people to play but, with. What? But the Topic Planet 3 will come out on November on PS3 and PS4. Right, guys? Yeah, okay. He wanted to tell you guys. All right, see ya. <laughs> so that being said, let's go check out those figurines. So, here we are guys, and this is the first statue. This is the one I got from Krypton's Fortress, right here. From, uh, it's the Infinite Crisis series, and I believe this one is the, this is the second one. Uh, let me double check that. So, this is the, um, Pajama Party Harley Quinn. It's uh, number two of uh, DC Collectors. As you can see, there's actually quite amazing art. This will be also, you can see the art on the uh, my Facebook there. There's a Green Lantern figurine. I'm debating here. Let's see if I can. I'm sorry for the image. It's a little blurry. I'm still working with a poor quality camera. So there's all her stuff. Let's open her up. I haven't opened it up yet, but I did uh, cut the uh, plastic. Of course. Of course. Alright. Let's move that down a little bit. So as you can see, there's Harley Quinn. I'm gonna have to untie her out. Just give me a sec here. So here she is. This is a, uh, as you probably can't see in the video here, uh, she actually has braces on her teeth here in the design. Uh, I like the uh, the pink tails. Too bad uh, they didn't design it so you can replace her head and do like the put the hood on. So I actually like this hood, and I'd like, I would like to see it with a, a different feature, but the head can't really, doesn't move, actually. Uh, the arms are about the only thing that can move, both arms. Uh, they can't bend, so there's limited bend to it, but I actually like the, the paint job that's done on it, uh, as well as the, the coloring and the details. Uh, I've actually, I didn't notice this when I first opened it, um, uh, before I did this. I was looking it over before I did the video um, at the bat symbol here on her underwear on the onesie and uh, I actually like these little uh, slippers the uh, bunny slippers that she has the uh, the Joker smile on them it's actually really really well detailed all the way around I'm um, just gonna put her right there there and uh, oh this is one of her weapons it's a uh, teddy bear on a stick, or in this case, a bedpost. Uh, duct tape there on the bottom, as well as on the, the bear's body. You can see the stuffing sticking out, and the uh, the little stitching. What's going on? Lip print mark here on the uh, bear's lip. Sorry. And it's actually pretty well done, like good detail, all the way around. Especially, even on the the wood, it actually has like a really nice finish. 
And you can see all the uh, nice, like, old style to the wood. You can see there's even, like, scratches on it that have uh, shown some wear and tear. So, for the price that uh, Krypton got it for, it was actually really good. I think he only paid about 20 bucks for it or something like that. Um, this is the, uh, the stand. Yay, stand. Uh, but uh, she also comes with a, a little gun here. I think it's like a Nerf dart gun or something like that. It's uh, not half bad. Look, kind of looks like a Nerf gun. But uh, that's her little weapon that she gets there. And uh, she also comes with a, a set of uh, specs. Yeah, she comes with her own little glasses here. Which I think is uh, pretty cool. Uh, you can just slip those on. No, I can't see any behind a camera for some reason. Come here. There. So yeah, leave her with glasses, or you can leave her without glasses. Whichever. Uh, so the other statue I have here is um, one of my statues that I got for Christmas. And it's the uh, DC Online Universe, or DC Universe Online. Uh, series and uh, the uh, the paint job on it's just just stunning I love the costume design they they kind of stuck with a nice classic design for her and uh, I just I love the detail that they did on the hammer like all the rigid detail right down to the handle and then like you see the roughs detail that's put in that uh, it's very the main reason why I like the statue, it's it's sleekness, it's the sexiness that comes with this character, um, and it always reminds me of the uh, the classic anime Batman animated series. And uh, the great thing about this one, uh, I was surprised to get it. It's actually marked 331 out of the 5,000 uh, of the uh, statues that were released. So these are the two statues I kind of wanted to show you guys there. As well as a little bit of the comic books that you can uh, see along the back there. I actually got more more than that of the series. So, if you guys like the video, um, subscribe if you already haven't. Uh, please like. And if you guys have any comics, please, comments, please place it down below. I'm sorry for the mistakes. And uh, like always, thank you for watching. So, uh, I'll be putting out two, also, on a side note, I'll be putting out two, and let me stop that. <laughs> <laughs> I will, I, I was supposed to put a video out last week, but I chose not to, and for those who are wondering whose hand did that, come here, you, come here, this is 3D Andrew, say hi. Hi. Okay, now say bye. <laughs> anyway, of, um, Dungeon Endless, he's making me lose my track of thought. Hi guys and welcome to Lowell's Den. I'm Julian and today I'm going to be doing a video of two Harley Quinn. <laughs> yes, you can see me on the camera. I know you can. Okay, go. <laughs> Anyways. <sighs> Hi guys and welcome to Lone Wolf's Den. I'm Julian and today I'm going to be going over a review. Take three.